Hello, John here from Human Design. So, big question that normally gets asked when people start the gym is, how do I know how much weight to lift? Okay, and it's a tricky question because all exercises are different, all muscle groups are different. So, the number one way and the easiest way for you to do this is to go by the repetitions in your program. So, that's whether you're following a program from men's health, women's health, or your coach. Um, so, you go by the rep ranges. So, let's look at two specific examples. Let's say your program says do three sets of 10 to 12 repetitions. So each time you move or do an exercise movement, that's one repetition and 10 to 12 repetitions equals one set, okay? So let's say it's three sets of 10 to 12 repetitions. So that means, first of all, you've got to get the weight inside that range, okay? So if you do eight reps, it's too heavy. If you do 15 reps, it's too light. So you want to fall in that range. But then secondly, your aim is to hit the top number. So if it says 10 to 12 repetitions, you try and get three sets of 12 repetitions before you then increase the weight the following workout or the following week, whenever, however you're doing your program. So week one, you might get 12, 11, 11. Week two, you might get 12, 12, 12. Then you put the weight up. Then you might get 10, 10, 10. Then 11, 11, 11. Then 12, 12, 12. That's how you know when to increase your weight, okay? And that's how you know also what way to lift. Now let's look at a second scenario, and that's a scenario where you're given a very specific repetition. So it might say do four sets of 10 repetitions. Now this is trickier to get the weight right, but again, you just do trial and error on your first set. You see how you get. If you get way more than 10, it's too light. If you get too far under 10, it's too heavy. But your aim is to get initially four sets of 10 repetitions. But then, in this case, you want to do two repetitions more with good technique. So week one, you might get four sets of 10, week two, four sets of 11, week three, four sets of 12. When you get the four sets of 12, then you increase the weight. So when it's a specific rep range, like eight reps or 10 reps, I always try and get my clients to do two reps above that number for, for the whatever number of sets it is with good quality technique before I increase the weight. So when you have a rep range of 12 to 15, you try and hit the top range and then you increase the weight. When you have a very specific number like 10 reps, you try and hit that 10 reps and then you get two reps above it, two quality reps above it before you increase the weight. This will be different for every exercise, I know that, but that is a good general guideline. Let me know below if that makes sense. Ask questions, I'm here to help. So yeah, I hope that makes sense. Have a great day.